Greetings, fellow portal masters. Greetings, fellow portal masters. I am Crash Charles, and it's once again time to crash the scouts with another episode of the Skylanders Trap Team Mini Lock here on the channel. Now, it's been a hot minute since I recorded one of these, so if I get mixed up with what we were doing last and all of that. Um, I did go back and watch the last episode so I can make sure I'm caught up with this, but as you guys may know, I am recording this in bulk, so I have all the episodes already recorded and all that, so there was a big gap between the last episode recording this one. It won't seem like anything to you. Why well, am I even talking about it? Who knows? Welcome to the mini lock. So if you don't know what the mini lock is, I'm not really going to go into detail about it, so I suggest you go back and watch some of the other episodes so you can be able to understand the rules, but if you are a newcomer to this channel, and why are you starting on this episode? But if you're not, then you already know what the what the locks are all about. So we're not going to waste any more time and hop right into the episode because I don't want to have these long, winded intros. So the last episode was huge. We had glitches. We had shocking moments. We had a Skylander that I thought was garbage clutch through the whole way. It was amazing. If you guys did not see last episode, please go back and watch it. Because um, as you see, the Skylanders down here, I think I got that right. I think they're right here. Please correct me if I'm wrong. It doesn't matter. Future me won't even care. Because... I've already got this edited. Haha! <laughs> Screw you, past me. I'm talking to myself in the future, talking to me now. Anyways, yeah. It was pretty great. But we are heading towards Dreamcatcher here now. We sh probably know where Dreamcatcher is. So. Even though Chaos's oh. last tip turned out to be legit, I'm still a little leery about trusting him. Makes sense. Right now, though, it's about the only lead we have. So I'm game to check it out. How about you? I guess so. We're gonna go to the Telescope Towers. Oh. Let's go get that evil dream catcher, and this time she's not getting away. So I'm not mistaken, this is the dream catcher level. It is okay. This was gonna be a little tough. I can say this, tell you this one advance, so I'm gonna be very focused on not dying for this. But as you know, I'm playing as just minis. We have lost two minis so far. Um, sucks that we lost two. So we still have another. What is it? Ten? No, fourteen. Cause it's eight each, right? Yeah. Well, there's two of each element, there's eight elements, so 16. Wow. The dream catcher must have already started stealing the dreams from these scientists Ooh. because this place used to look like a pretty normal observatory, and now it's whatever this is. I don't like that. I just hope she wasn't able to learn anything from their weird dreams yet. So let's wake up the sleeping scientists, take down that dream catcher. Sprout isn't curious. She's the why he's just like right now. Yeah, I hate when that happens too. Um, so, I want to apologize in advance if for some reason the gameplay audio is only coming out of one of your headphones, if you're listening to this on headphones. I honestly don't know how to fix it. I really don't. Um, I'm going to quickly check the audio and see maybe if I can do it that way. Because I think if you go to audio, it just gives you the option to turn everything up and down so I can't uh, do like stereo or mono. Because I think mono is what I need, but I can't do it for that for some reason. It makes no sense. Look, here's how to play the game. But yeah, let's get right back into the game here now. So sorry, I'm really sorry if you can't hear it that well. Or if you can hear it, it's just coming out of one headphone. But if you listen to it on, the, on your computer, as far as I know, it sounds perfectly fine through regular speakers. Because when I'm editing this, it sounds perfectly fine. So. Oh. Skylander! Head work. Long time no see, huh? Since we made such a great team back at the swamps, I thought that might help you out here too. Maybe. Did we make a great team though? I let you in and then you opened the door for me and I if I'm not mistaken that was the last time I seen you so Really? Man oh man if I was the first time playing this game I tell you I, I wouldn't know what he's talking about oh, I see the problem here these post blocks are just out of alignment Push them back into position and I'll fire up the generator. Duh. Sounds like a plan, huh? Sounds like a good plan. He's gonna fire up a generator. That is awesome. Needs that generator. If your name is Jen, leave a comment below. And we'll get you and you could be a, a raider. Generator. See? That did something good. Now use that pump button to get up, and we can finally reactivate this bridge. No, the reason I'm like kind of talking nonsense is because I've been having a pretty good, pretty good couple days from when I recorded this. I'm not going to go into detail because that makes the video very dated, but like things are going good is the best way to describe it. Everything's going good right now. I had a good day today while I was, before I filmed this. Still, I'm having a terrible day now. No, I'm joking. I just haven't recorded this in a while, so it's really cool. 
and watch out for some equally weird hazards along the way. I think if I'm not mistaken, the next level after this is the halfway point. Um, if I'm not mistaken, I may be wrong. So. That was interesting. Did you see that? I sneezed and Spyro just appeared at the exact same time. Alright, sorry about that. <laughs> Here's a fun thing. I'll, I'll, after Hedwig talks to you, I gotta tell you a random funny story that has nothing to do with me, but in general. I have a really bad hangnail. Sorry if it looks like a bite in my nails because I actually am. Look at that whale! Look at that whale! Look at that whale! That button up there should pump blocks up and out. That was cool. How to get there? Hmm. 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 Oh, I bet it has something to do. Why am I tired? Down this path, but maybe that's just me. Oh, I kind of got woken up today by a friend. By my friend. <laughs> um, but yes. Yeah, so I don't know if you guys watch wrestling. I know a couple of you guys in the channel watching the channel do. Uh, they're the owner of wrestling, Vince McMahon. He hates sneezing because you can't control it. I'm not making this up. He doesn't like sneezing because it can't be controlled. Like, that's the weirdest thing to dislike. Like, he does not like sneezing because you can't control a sneeze. It's wild. It's actually wild to think about. He doesn't like that. Anyways, we're getting to our first battle. It's water! It's your boy, Thumpling, coming into the game here now. Hail to the whale! Hail to the whale! Sorry. Ugh. I've been here to more of my fault, but I'm afraid your ruining days are over, you ruiner. I mean, soon to be former ruiner. Dreamcatcher would have been a really cool villain to reintroduce in Imaginators. I don't know how they would do it, and that's why I think it would be really cool. Gotta watch out for these uh, eyeball guys. They almost took out Ninjini in the last episode. Really suggest you go back and watch the last episode if you did not. It's got it. It's one of the best. It's probably the best episode of the series so far, in my opinion. Well, I guess you have to be more not being picky or anything. No matter. All I need to do is slow you down a little while I continue to steal the dreams of these scientists. And since that's exactly what I just did, yay me. Good job for slowing me down for maybe a whopping three seconds. But yeah, she uh, she slowed us down there, but. I don't know, I find it funny about the Vince McMahon thing. He doesn't like sneezes because you can't control it. So, it's one of the dumbest, funniest things I think I may have ever read. <laughs> it's true, too. It actually is true. Like, a, a former press, I think, a former guy who was working with Vince McMahon said that because he said it in a meeting once. I'm already on it, my dude. There we go. All right. All right. All right. But yeah, since we're in this area, I do have something quickly on time. I mean, of course, answer the question of the day that's there on the side, right above the um, what scanners are left and all that. But I watched Doctor Strange recently. It was my first time watching it. I don't know if you guys watch Marvel movies, but I watched Doctor Strange. It was so good. Like, really good movie. I'm very excited for a second one when it comes out. Because I had never seen Doctor Strange, but I've seen all the Avenger movies. I started watching Doctor Strange, and for some reason I paused the movie and didn't unpause it. So, a friend of mine came over, we sat down, we watched Doctor Strange, and I loved it. Like, she's seen it, she loved it. And myself, I was watching, I was like, man, this is real, I was so really, really blown away by it, because I had other people who've seen it and loved it. So I decided to watch it. So, like, it was a, I was just wondering, like, have you, do you watch Marvel movies? If you do, how'd you like Doctor Strange? That's what I like to know. And by the time I upload this video, I'm going to be like, people are going to be talking about Doctor Strange, and I'm like, it was like six months ago, what am I talking about? Classic. Just follow those platforms speed run. Wake up all the Classic speed run. Be careful not to fall off of them. Don't tell them what to do. I can fall off all of them I want. I don't care. What's safety? Safety is dumb. There's something in my mouth. <laughs> those scientists are fast asleep. Keep attacking the beds until they wake up. Don't worry. You won't hurt them or anything. It's like I got oatmeal in my mouth. I can't say the last time I had oatmeal. There you go. See, he's totally fine. Don't like that. Nope, don't like that. 
Come on. All right. Sorry about that random oatmeal interlude. <laughs> Am I going to call this episode? Maybe. Magic element, you're back, Spry. Or should I say Sphery? wonder how many people are going to get angry at that. Because I did call him Spry for a while, and people were like, his name is Sphery, and I'm like, that makes no sense. Spryro. Spryro sounds good. Hello. There's only ex girlfriend says to me. I'm just joking. My girlfriends don't talk to me. I thought I might slow you down again. And if you should happen to get really, really hurt during the process, all the better. Ta it's true. She's very mean. She's very good at this villain thing. Have you noticed that? She's a very good villain. She's very mean. Easy. Come on. Come on. Give me some more eyeballs. Oh my god! That was incredibly easy for some reason. Jeez, she had those guys that like jump in the air and they shoot the um, things at you. And she just, she just walked it off. Weird. I just like took them out in seconds. What in the world was that? Alright, not gonna complain. Not gonna complain about uh, beating those, those level or those enemies pretty easily. <laughs> I'll take it! But here we go. Look at that. Mwah. But yeah, about the Marvel movies, uh, my friend hasn't seen Ant-Man, so we're going to be watching that soon. Because if you guys might know, Ant-Man is my favorite. I love... He's not my favorite Marvel superhero. My favorite Marvel superhero will obviously be the Punisher. He's excellent. Um, but Ant-Man is definitely my favorite movie from the franchise. And Ant-Man and the Wasp was amazing. Even better than the first, in my opinion. So... But yeah, that's our discussion today. So answer the question of the day right over there and talk about your favorite Marvel characters and movies. That's our discussion for today. <laughs> and the random wrestling thing. Because we're going to get more into the episode now when we get taken on Hoodsickle and Peñata and all those, man, members of uh, Skylar Survivor. Hey, that series is definitely over by now. <laughs> Hope you guys enjoyed it. Hope the person who won enjoys their prize. I'm at this moment. The di okay, we're going to date it now. Episode 16 comes out tomorrow. That's your date. That's how you know when I film this. If for some reason you want to find out why I filmed it, or when I filmed it, you can go ahead. Come on, Pinata. Now, here's the thing. I played Trap Team on a live stream ages ago, and I kind of, let's say, life hacked the game. Best way to describe it. Oh, I gotta do a game of Sky Stones. Been playing Sky Stone Smash in here ever since, and I'm pretty good. Think you can beat me? No. Nope. Well, first of all, you must be I crazy. Can't you. But second of all, if you do manage to win, I will give you the key. Stupid. Whatever you say, confirmed crazy person. He says I'm crazy, but I gotta beat him in a game to confirm that I'm crazy, or I don't know. It makes no sense. It's very dumb. It's very dumb, and I hate it. All right. Bruiser Cruiser. Bruiser Cruiser stuff. We're gonna start off with the Brawlrus. Take him out. Bruiser Cruiser. Another Bruiser Cruiser man. How many times do I have to teach you this lesson, old man? Please tell me if you got that reference. Oh yes, here we go. I five with his four attack. Heckle to the Echo. Alright, see if we can get lucky. I beat him. Hey, I didn't know I beat him actually. Cool. Hey, your victory defies scientific explanation too. What's up with that science? <laughs> ha! Science. Am I right? But ding boom. By the time I wake up, everything will make sense again. Makes sense. Good night. Oh, yeah. And here's the key. How'd you get that outside there, buddy? You I can do it. Yeah. <laughs> no, I can do it. If I'm not mistaken, we are getting close to the hood sickle battle. Ready or not? Yeah, the hood sickle battle's coming up. Undead element. Let's go, high jinx. Here we go, girl. So, fun fact. You remember how my Hex lost an arm? She lost her other one. I know. Very sad. Her other arm fell off when I went looking for her the other day for uh, a video. Or a live stream me and Jack did. I just had the strangest dream. I had the strangest dream, too. I had the strangest dream the other day, actually. I had a dream. I only took a nap. Like, I was asleep for maybe three hours, if anything. And you know, I'll talk about when I take on uh, the sickle here. Waking everybody up. It's like you have 
have now become my worst nightmare. Yeah. I've Irony! But it be total bummer. But what I do know is I'm about to send more evil minions your way. Plus a special surprise I won't ruin. <gasps> See ya. Oh dang it, I ruined it for her. But yeah. I had a dream the other day when I was taking my nap. I woke up and uh well, I was asleep, and I felt like I was still awake. I don't know if you heard those dreams where, like, you're asleep, but you are awake, so you, like, if I was awake looking at my TV, I could see what was happening on the TV and everything, so, like, I just had some random show on, I forget what it was, and I could see the show, I could s hear the audio and all that, but I could hear someone screaming my name the whole time. So, just randomly Googled it, looked up, like, is there maybe a reason? Because, you know, you can look up all your dreams and stuff online, right? So, I'm going to be looking down here, I'm not going to be looking at the camera. Um, so, you can look up your dreams, and they'll give you, like, there's usually meanings towards them. So, I looked it up, and the fact that I, that, uh, I was just awake means I was anticipating something. It means I had something I was looking forward to. Your time is running I was looking forward to Hoodsicker right now. <laughs> You're going down, old man! Oh, she's leveled up. Oh, come on. Oh, it didn't hit me. Ha, 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 punk. How many times I gotta teach you this lesson, old man? I love how he's got this little, like, the fire stick thing, but then it turned into the, uh, scythe in the, in the Imagineers. This is, like, the easiest fight ever. Come on, Hoodsickle. Step up, bro. You're never gonna win Skylar Survivor if you're like that. Actually, you might have won. Who knows? Shout out to him if you did. So I looked it up, and supposedly what it is, what that means is that you defeat Hoodsicle, and it means that you're anticipating something. So at that time, I had to get up and record my audio for Skylar Survivor. So this was Sunday, not that long ago, so the day I filmed this, this was like three, three days ago, something like that? So I looked it up, and I said I was anticipating something, like I had something that I was needed to get done that I was looking forward to, which was recording the audio for Skylar Survivor. So I'm like, oh, okay, I'm like, that makes sense. Then I looked up the audio for, or the thing for someone yelling your name in their sleep, your sleep. So I'm just like, all right, what could this be? Looked it up and I found out that something bad is going to happen in the future, like in the near future. And um, happy to say that nothing really bad happened that day. Like it was supposed to be within 24 hours and nothing bad happened. I ended up not sleeping well that night is the best way to describe it because I stayed at my friend's house and didn't really sleep well so it was funny I didn't sleep well that day that that day like I got home and it was still pretty early in the day and oh, I didn't go to sleep that night till like 11 o'clock at night so like I was up for a while and I had barely any sleep so it was a good day it was a very good day that was the day I watched Doctor Strange actually that next day so it was like, no, it was, it was overall just a good day. I got this weird ringing going on right now. Like, when I talk, I can hear myself. If I go, hmm, 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 hmm. For some reason, I can hear that in my right earphone. I don't know. It might, it's probably not the earphones just being bad. Because they're a Sony brand. They're really good. They're not old. So, I don't know what it could be. It might just be, because I'm usually listening to these not really what talking. I'm usually just, you know, listening to music like a normal person, and I don't really talk when I have the headphones on. So maybe I'll switch to earbuds, and that'll be different, because I have, I have three kinds of headphones now. I have the over-ear ones, I have the on-ear ones, where, like, they hook into this part, and then I want to go all the way in the ear. So, I have three different kinds. So, oh, now since I put my headphone on this way, there's no little rattle. Oh, no, it's back. Never mind. You guys probably have no clue on time. They're like, oh, this guy's crazy. Unsub. Ding! Right down there, hit the bell icon. Magic element, welcome back, Spyro. Sorry, Spry. What could they call it? What else could they have called Spyro? Think about it. Instead of Spyro, a mini version of Spyro. What could they have? Uh, what could they have named them? You guys come up with it. I know you guys are pretty good at coming up with names. I mean, you guys came up with tree tree pecs in. Uh, in the giant lock, which was great. And Tree Pex has moved on. We Pex now. We Rex and We Pex. Don't know if they'll make an appearance this episode. I do have them in the uh, waiting party right now. Oh, it's Pinata time. Here we go. I love Pinata, but like. I'm gonna stick it to you. 
Okay, Pinata's good. That's the problem. Pinata's really good. Can I hit him from here? Let's see if I can use my... So, if I'm not mistaken, I did this in a live stream a while ago. I'm gonna try this. I don't know if it's gonna work. I don't think it's gonna work. No, it isn't. Dang it. Okay, we gotta actually fight him. Alright, here we go. Here we go, ladies and gentlemen. This is gonna be a fight here now. Obviously. Spyro can fly, so that might help me. Ugh, okay, here we go. This is really all I can do, is just try to run away from him, do a couple of hits. Let's go. Ugh. Oh my god, come on. There we go. Oh, come on, buddy. We can do this. Oh, come on. Ugh. Jeez, come on, let's do this. Slowly but surely, we're chipping away at him. I think we're gonna do it, ladies and gentlemen. We are getting Pinata defeated here now. BAM! Boom! We broke that Pinata! That was good. That was good with these. I don't even care that you beat me. I now have a friend. <laughs> Just kidding. We don't trap villains in this playthrough. These guys don't want pain, yata. Pain, yata, da, yata, da. So we're getting very close now to the Doomlander battle with Dreamcatcher. And I almost done this episode. This is a very good episode so far. We're doing really well. Dreamcatchers, if I'm not mistaken, isn't a hard one. But, I mean, that's the problem. It's not a hard one, but it could still be very simple mistakes that we take to, uh, to ruin our play, our run on this. As I said, I don't want to lose any more Skylanders, because it already happened. We broke that. We've already broke that um, tradition now. We've unfortunately lost two, so nothing else we can do about it. Don't like it. Oh, how'd you get up here? Boy, I, bet you're wondering what happened to me, huh? I did a little bit. Some read a fan fiction about what happened with Hedwig, and I will read it on the channel. What happened in between? Okay, this is... So it looks like we are taking on Dreamcatcher as Spry. Alright, Spry, time to step up. Another magic Skylander stepping up. Let's go. I've already learned the secrets of Tractanium from these scientists' dreams. But this whole hero thing you're doing is getting really tiresome, so I think it's time I finally put an end to it. Okay. Dreamcatcher. Was that spot on? Did it seem believable? Yeah, here we go, here we go. Alright, I think we might be okay with this. Spyro is overall a good Skylander, that's the thing. So, Spry, sorry. Can I hit you? Can I hit you, please? Oh, this is where they all start falling apart on me. Ugh. I don't like this one, because uh, you get fall damage. If you fall off, you get you, you lose health. Nice, nice, nice. We're doing well so far. How did I just get hurt? What did I just get hurt by? What was that? Oh, we are doing extremely well. Sheep, why are you doing this to me? Hold on. Wait a freak, frick, frack, snick, snack. Hold on. When Spiral flies, oh my god, I don't step on the thing. Ooh, life hack. I'm out of dream energy. You sure are. Sorry, I fell asleep. She said someone fell asleep, so I did. I was helping her out. Oh, no! Oh, that was close. Did I hit her? Oh, I got her. Okay, okay let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go, boys. Oh, I fell off the edge. Okay, I got a little bit of health gone. No problem. No problem. No problem, Bobble. No problem, Bobble. Who? Who's Bobble? Someone I should know about. Come on, we got this. Oh, we got her. Yeah, boys and girls, we did it. That was a not bad level. We did really well with that. Because I've said it before, after the first two with Chompy Mage and Chef Pepperjack, the bosses get pretty easy. Wolfgang is pretty tough from what I remember because you got to kind of memorize his patterns. So I think Wolfgang is going to be the next toughest one. Um, we may lose this guy with Crankcase, but uh, 
Right now we did it, and we leveled up Portmaster rank five. I was gonna go like this, but that's ten. That's a perfect ten, like Ty Dillinger. Back to wrestling again. Let's give us a little cutscene here now. Let's see what's up. Let's see what's up. What's up? What's up? What am I talking about? What's up? Nice job apprehending that evil dream catcher, Skylander. Thanks. Yes. Someone meme this. Our good buddy Chaos. Just bump me, Chaos. This mill. You know what? We're gonna say the word next episode after we open up this thing. Let's see, Spree. Spree, what do we got, Spree? Huh, Spree? What do we have, Spree? What could it be, Spree? It is... A hat. Hats are illegal. If you guys enjoyed this episode, let me know by leaving a like and a comment below. Remember to answer the question today. Talk about Marvel movies. Discuss with people in the comments. You might find your new best friend. Just saying. But if you guys enjoyed, you gotta let me know by leaving some love below. And if you're new to the channel, give us a subscribe. Hit the bell. You'll get video notifications all the time when they come out. Hopefully. It works for Japs videos for me, so it should work for you. But as always, I bid you farewell.